caught on camera, a close encounter with a mountain lion. New tonight, we're hearing from the hunter who was there and says the cougar swatted at her leg. New specialist Mike Anderson talked with her about the encounter and Mike, how she got away. Yeah, Dini and Mike, you know, uh, Lauren Elshaw, Lorian Elshaw says that, you know, she's in the woods a lot. She was able to, grateful she was able to walk out of there alive. But, uh, you know, as a hunter, she's been there before. She's seen mountain lions, but never quite in an encounter like this. Babe. You can hear the stress, the tension in her voice. Holy shit. Lorian Elshaw. My friends were, like, up on the hill. And I was in the bottom of the ravine, walking up towards the top of the mountain. On the opening day of the archery hunt over the weekend, out in the woods of Rush Valley, something she's done many times before when she says she smelled what seemed like a dead animal. And then to my right, I heard crashing and felt something like swipe my leg. And I looked down. And it took me a second to realize that I was face to face with a mountain lion. It took her a few moments to decide to start recording. I started yelling like up the hill to everyone like mountain lion and like letting them know. Elshaw says Fish. she backed up into thick trees and shrubs, ultimately having to get closer to the cougar to later back off. I have a thing on my pack where I put my phone to record and I actually didn't mean to end the video. I was, as I was putting my phone in to capture, I ended the video and thought I was recording way more. So the video was cut off, but she says even after she backed up all the way up the hill to her friends. It followed us for about a mile before turning around and just bolting back down to the canyon to its food. She says it's likely she stumbled upon the mountain lion's meal and it decided to protect it, but adds that if you're going to be in the great outdoors. Just be aware you're not alone in the mountains. Um, it's their territory, so go prepared. And the Division of Wildlife Resources says, you know, if you run into a cougar, back up slowly, maintain eye contact, stand tall and talk in a loud voice, and prepared to, be prepared to protect yourself, too. Uh, Elshaw says that uh, she had to actually hit it a couple times with her hiking stick as it got too close. Dan, back to you. Wow, Mike, it helps to review these things because in the moment, no doubt, you're terrified. Uh, but that's what you got to do to stay safe. Mike, thanks.